guys, so hopefully you don't mind the lighting because I don't know what happened to my big lamp, but it doesn't want to turn on anymore. And it has like a 10 year light bulb lifetime, so that's kind of weird because it, has, it hasn't even been six months. Anyways, I got sponsored by two companies, cutesygirl.com, which you guys know I've been a fan since way before I even started making YouTube videos. I'm an accurachicago.com. I'm going to start off with the wedges. Um, wedges for the summertime and springtime for me are a must just because they look really cute with floral dresses or pretty much they match a lot of the stuff that I have especially if they're in a neutral color which is why I got these brown ones and they're by Bamboo which is a brand that I never heard of until I got some stuff from Cutesy Girl um, they're a size 6 um, the only thing about these though is that if you are a well, you should go a size lower uh, because the size 6 fits me a little bit big around the ankle. And if I would have gotten like a 5.5, I would have definitely fitted into them a lot more comfortably than these. But they still work. It's just that my ankle looks a little bit awkward. They look like that. They got detailing. They're strappy. They're wedges. And for me being short, I love heels. But heels to get really uncomfortable over time so I like to wear a lot of wedges even to school I don't wear heels to school but I'll wear wedges and then I picked out these uh, brown booties and I really really like these actually I've been wearing them a few times already um, one thing that really caught my attention was the heel it's not straight it's bent and I forgot which designer has um, I think Alexander McQueen has some shoes like that, but it's another designer. But the heel is bent, so it gives the shoe like a different shape from the back. And these are really comfy um, little boots. And I got them in a brown. They look like that. They're very simple. Okay, so of course all the shoes that I picked out are pretty much daytime shoes or for class, just not really in nighttime so I wanted to get a pair of heels that I could rock with like some really cute dresses for the nighttime and I found these there's some caged heels um, they zip up through the back and then they have like this really cool chain going up and down kinda like if it was tied into it which I think makes it look really edgy and these are so so cute especially if you if you don't like wearing dresses I love wearing like skirts and dresses but if you don't like wearing dresses like black skinny jeans or any skinny jeans would look so cute with this even if you have like a boot cut to kind of go over it these are really cute two of my favorite shoes um, just because let me show you real quick two different colors um, light pink and lavender I don't have pink shoes I don't think I don't have a lot I believe it's like my second pair of pink shoes so these are some flats and they have them in different colors. They definitely have them like in a black or like like a more wearable color that you can match with a lot of outfits. But I don't have pink shoes. So I wanted to get these flats. And they have a little cuff here. Um, you do have to be careful with cuffs um, and flats together. Especially if you're short. I'm really short. I got them anyway. But I like to wear short shorts. So um, anything below the kneecap, it's really... If you wear like a uh, caprice pants or a skirt beneath the kneecap it's gonna make your legs look it's just gonna cut you off in the wrong places and you're gonna look shorter and then I got these lavender flats which are so cute I love purple this is such a pretty baby purple and they're just some simple flats but I really love they're by bamboo too but I really love the straps here they kinda just cuff around your leg so that makes them really cute last pair of shoes that I picked out from Cutesy Girl are some boots and a sandal all in one because I was like, a boot and a sandal together but I really like these um, they look like this, they're just light brown, they have studs here which are edgy, they also have chains and they're just a sandal the foot is like this, like they have, it has all this extra space but um, I use jeans to fill them out because I really really wanted these so here we have it and then I got just a few accessories I'm actually gonna have a small giveaway on dulcecandy.com if you're a reader excuse me because my eyes like twitching I was actually filming a tutorial on this look I have to film it again because I only filmed the first part and the second part was not filmed so anyways um, 
like I said, I was going to have, well, I am going to have um, a small giveaway. This is just for my readers on dulcecandy.com. And I got myself one of these. I don't know if you don't like pink. I'm sorry, but pink is one of my favorite colors. And it's just a bib necklace with a bunch of little, like, uh, roses. And then it has pearls. So something very, 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 very girly. And it looks like that. Um, this one is mine, but I have another one for a giveaway on dulcecandy.com. And then I got something a little bit more edgier since I've been into edgy pieces lately too. And this is just a bracelet. It's plastic, it's gold, and it has stud. It Well, it's like spiked all over, which I think is pretty awesome. Really, really edgy, something different. And I don't really have a lot of accessories that look like this. So... There you have it. And now for the next store, which is Affordable Fashion Trends. Something like Forever 21, Wet Seal, something along the lines like that. Um, it might be a little bit more pricier. It's a better quality than Forever 21. So, so they sent me over three things, really affordable. This dress is $30. And this is a denim. I don't know if you guys, there's like this big denim trend. So there's this, this is a small um, dress in denim metallic so it's really really shiny strapless and then it has an exposed zipper in the back I don't know if you guys are into it but this is really form-fitting I'm just going to have to hem it up about maybe two inches because it's a little bit too long for me but it fits me really well it's just a little bit too long which is really easy to fix so there you have it really cute dress you will probably see it on dulcecandy.com styled completely and then they also sent me this bracelet which is my favorite and it came in a little box which made it even like more special because I love packaging and packaging has a lot to do with how a product sells so when I got it like they didn't just send it to me like oh here you know they sent it in a cute little box and those are extra points for me and it's just like this aqua um, light green baby green color and this has gold lining in the inside and stretchy and it's just an, a touch of color to any outfit so if you're wearing like all black this would be like a perfect touch of color okay and now let me show you this dress this is the um, other dress that they sent me this is um, like a really satiny feel to it um, and it looks like this you cinch it up at the waist it has this little belt by the same fabric and it's actually kinda like a wrap like this is really really good this is, especially if you have like um, a lot of curves up here or if you're a little bit heavier in the midsection a wrap dress really slims you down so it just looks like that and it's racer back it is so cute I love it anyways that's pretty much all that I um, received from cutesy girl and accuratechicago.com all the information is going to be on down below and also if you're interested how to see how I style all these outfits you can go to dulcecandy.com and the link would be down below as well um, and that's usually where I style all my outfits I'm really really proud of my blog so hopefully you get a chance to read it and just as a little side note I know a lot of people seem to attack the gurus when they get sponsored by companies and I've said this before but just because a guru gets sponsored doesn't make the quality of the product any bad or the company itself any bad that's just something to keep in mind because gurus seem to get attacked every time um, they get sponsored as you guys know I would never make a video unless I love it you guys know I make forever 21 videos and they don't sponsor me and I buy all that stuff myself so cutesygirl.com I've made videos before where I bought stuff this is a new company and I know I don't have to explain myself, but this is just something that I do have to say because if not, people will start attacking. So anyways, um, that is all. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!